my name is Ariane and I study international business with marketing management at CBS and I just got back from my amazing semester abroad in London. What did I expect when I first came to London? I expected to really get to know the city plus I really expected to get to know people from all over the world to just have a good time I guess. I definitely did not expect to have a culture shock um, because England is so close to Germany but when I got there I did have one in the end. You will have to get used to people running around half naked all the time. They won't wear any jackets, they won't wear any scarves basically throughout the year. You have reduced tube service at night so you will have a hard time getting home after midnight even on a weekend. People are crossing red lights all the time. I definitely wasn't used to that. <laughs> I'm just waiting there. My grandmas will just casually walk over a busy street in slow motion basically. And you always have to reserve a table in a good restaurant weeks in advance partially. Otherwise you have to wait two hours for a spot. What impressed me the most about London was how much the city itself has to offer. We could have spent easily every day in the city exploring and still um, we wouldn't see everything that there is to be seen. I loved how many good pubs, bars, clubs, live music, um, theatres, street markets you can find in London. Basically there's always something going on somewhere. You can easily just run into a movie premiere by accident or walk into someone famous without even noticing. For example, one time we just randomly walked into a club, suddenly there was Steve Aoki and One Direction partying and we were just like, ooh, hello. <laughs> there's so much great stuff to be seen. So literally on every corner there's something historical that has some sort of story to tell. So in fact I had a hard time seeing everything that I was planning on seeing or doing. I was just running out of time so quickly. I am also such a big fan of Harry Potter. I love how you could actually visit movie locations. I even made it to a premiere once um, where I could catch a glimpse of J.K. Rowling and that was just amazing, one of my favorite memories. <laughs> what I will miss the most about London are definitely the people. Yeah, I've met friends pretty much from everywhere. I will also miss living in such a vibrant, vivid and international city. That was just an amazing experience to make.